Okay guys, John the Van Guy again. Hi. Now this is another problem today. Um, you can see I've taken off the bottom valance. It needs work on here, that's another issue. I'll do that with fiberglass matting. But the big thing was when I took it off, this is what was left. The bar behind. I've taken off, cut out some of the rust and I'll treat that bar. But this is very typical to found. The actual mounting strut which holds the uh, helps to hold that big fender on has broken off. So now I went round the other side and this has obviously happened in the past and this is how they coped with it. They put this uh, rectangular piece in. Now what they've done is, if you look up here, uh, they put a rectangular strip across, welded it to the base, to that base, uh, and then about seven and a half inch strip here, and another strip down. So they've made this sort of L attached to this. So I thought I'd probably do something similar. And I've got myself some uh, not one and a half by one, not the rectangle, but a friend of mine kindly gave me some square um, square pipe. This is is it? Now I've just what I'm doing is I'm, I'm, I've cut a piece across. Now I'm going to show it slightly differently. Um, this is the base. You see it from inside the vehicle, um, which I need to attach this bar to. I've cut this bar is about eight inches. Now, what I, instead of just cutting a small piece onto that, what I'm doing going to do is I've noticed. I've gone right across to this uh, chassis bit here, which comes down to the front, it's already got a hole in it actually, so you could theoretically put a bolt through to this bar and hold the bar, but I think a single piece of metal on here wouldn't have a lot of support. So to, to actually support this, what I'm actually going to try and do is uh, I'm going to weld right across this bar, I made it slightly longer so it goes right across. Weld to the body here and weld along here. And then, hopefully, I'll put um, a piece going perpendicular to that coming out here. And from that, I'll do a, an extension. Now, I can, I can once I've, I've uh, drawn it all out, uh, marked it all out, I'll probably be able to arc weld. It's quite thick steel. Arc weld this as one piece, then weld it onto, uh, there's this thinner metal here, weld it onto this. So I've noticed I need to allow about one and a half inches coming about to about out of here. So I need to go from that strut uh, and I worked at about seven and a half inches will give me a one and a half clearance. But to, to show where the original thing was, <laughs> what I did was simply make this cardboard cutout with the uh, hole in it to show where the original bolt was and line it up on the body there. Now if I push that back onto that bar I can actually mark through that hole onto the bar where I'm going to put the piece on to go across here. Get the idea? Well, obviously this is going to need fixing as well, but this is this is the first job. So I'm going to have a bar coming across here and an extension downwards, and that should act as a new support. Actually, I've drilled a hole in it. A new support for the hold um, valance. And there you go, that's, uh, I'll show you the, probably the finished article rather than take you through all the 
drilling and the good old angle grinding. Uh, there we are, another one for today.